hey you guys welcome or welcome back to my channel in today's video i'm going to be doing a much needed pamper routine your girl in school i got a kid i'm still trying to start up my own business and i have a job so your girl needs a break so in order to do that i'm going to do everything in my willpower to spoil myself tonight so i'm going to switch over my old sheets for my new sheets and y'all ignore my window treatments right now because i'm still contemplating on what i want for my room and this is nowhere near what i want so we're just going to ignore that okay mind y'all business worry, worry about y'all self okay okay but yeah fresh new sheets the best feeling ever and we're going to start off with a clean tub and to set the mood for myself i'm going to grab some tea light candles i didn't want any scented candles but you could opt for those if you want to but the bath stuff i'm going to be using i want all the aroma from that and not no candles i'm going to start my bath water I'm going to go on with this Dr. Till's Pure Epsom Salt. This is like the melatonin one. This is my first time using it. And then I'm going to go on with their foaming bath. I really wanted this one because of the peppermint scent. And I love, love, love peppermint. And then I'm going to go in with this bath bomb that I've got from Walmart. Everything that I'm showing you guys today, I got from Walmart. And this color is so gorgeous. Like, oh my gosh. It was just so gorgeous. Okay, so while I let my bath water run, I'm going to go ahead and do my hair real quick because it's... It's a little meh, but I am going to take take it out of its bun and give it a nice shampoo, deep condition it, and leave that on for the duration of my bath. And the spray bottle is rice water. I'm gonna put a plastic shower cap over my head to let this marinate as well while I'm in a bath. Now, most people take a shower and then a bath, but I don't like that concept at all. It's just my opinion though. But I like to take a bath, soak and all that stuff and then shower. That makes the most sense to me. And then I forgot, but I did go in and add some apple cider vinegar to my water. And after I soak, I am going to shave. Just 
just unwind and relax. And I soak for like a good 30 to 45 minutes. And I had the bathroom lights off as well. Just, just set the mood for yourself. Okay, so after soaking, before I shave, I grab soap and wash all the body parts that I'm going to end up shaving just because I don't want to think, just because I don't like shaving on a dirty body. I have to wash that area first and then shave. I just don't want my razor to get dirty. I don't know. I'm, I'm just like that. <laughs> Okay, so after soaking and shaving in the shower, I always work from top to bottom. That way, like the stuff from my hair is going to run down my body. So it doesn't make sense to wash and then rinse the stuff out of the shower. That's backwards to me. So I start with my hair first and rinse the conditioner out. And I'm going to apply my leave-in while it's soaking wet. And I'm going to twist that out of the way. After that, I'm going to wash my hands and then go ahead and wash my face. And tip, I didn't show it in this video, but typically after I wash my face, I go ahead and use a separate rag or a separate um, washcloth for my feet. <laughs> I'm just really funny acting with feet. I don't like other people's feet. I don't like my feet. I just don't like feet at all. So it gets its own rag. Okay, so we are finally washing. Do not rush at all. Take y'all time. Do what y'all need to do. But it's on to my washing phase. I'm going to use my African little sponge thingy that I've got from Walmart. Um, I first heard of this on Naturally Nisi's channel. And I decided to try one and I like it. I got mine from Walmart. I think she got hers off of Amazon. This isn't my first. No, I got this one from Target. The very first one I had. I got from Walmart and I don't know what happened to it and I don't recommend using this on freshly shaved armpits or any other part of the body because it was a little abrasive. And I'm going to take this body scrub from Tree Hut Brown Sugar. This is the only one I use from this brand. It smells oh so good and delicious. I highly recommend this one because, oh my gosh, the scent is amazing. I did that inside the shower personally because it's a mess. It's a huge mess to use, so I didn't want to make a mess. But heading upstairs, I get dressed upstairs. I cannot stand getting dressed in the bathroom. I'm going to apply one of my lotions that I've been testing out and I absolutely love. So, yeah. And for my feet, I put lotion on top of each foot and rub it in like you would with your hands instead of with your feet and slip into something comfortable that's silky silk on a nicely freshly shaved body just felt also amazing so that's what I decided to wear 
moving on to my oral care i'm going to brush my teeth and then i'm going to floss and then i'm going to use mouthwash And then after that, I'm going to be applying my favorite chapstick. And then I'm going to go ahead and go on into my skincare. This is a chemical exfoli exfoliant. And um, I'm hoping to get a video up using these products. But I honestly haven't been consistent with them and I want to give a fair honest review but I'm gonna let this sit for 10 minutes and rinse this off my face and come back My face felt so smooth after, especially my nose. Oh my gosh. And then I'm just gonna go in with this product. Now, when I apply products to my face, I sit up there and rub it in, honestly, for like a hot minute so I can make sure it's soaked into my skin. Alrighty, face routine is done. I was gonna do my hair, but that's not really pampering or relaxing, so I decided to opt it out. And I also got this fragrance from Naturally Nisi, Nisi as well, and this smells oh so good. Oh my gosh, I can't get enough of the scent. It's it's just <sighs> y'all gotta get it for yourself and smell it. But I want to smell good when I go to sleep, so I'm gonna apply that. And that is it for today's video, you guys. Thank you guys for coming back to my channel. Do not forget to give this video a thumbs up. And comment down below, what's y'all routine? Do you guys have a specific routine for summer and winter? Let me know in the comments down below. I'll see y'all in my next one.